All right, let's do a painting. A lot of people have asked me about my reference materials. Like if I have a, I don't know, some super magic power on or some secret on, on reference materials. I want to demystify this whole reference material thing because um, it's just sad. It, it, it stops artists from creating artwork. The, the magic is not in the reference, guys. The magic is in your painting. Okay, so let's get this started. I'm gonna get a number, this is a number 12 flat brush. It's one of those Simmons brushes. They're not expensive, you can get them anywhere. Two, three dollars, five dollars at most. That's what I've known them to cost. And the trick is to play all of the angles of the brush as needed right you, you, don't, you don't have to use them if you don't need them but as needed you can only find that out in practice no matter how much an artist tells you that you're not gonna you're not gonna start using it to your advantage until you start figuring it out on your own in, in your own practice every every edge every angle of the brush is a is a is a friend you know, it's a tool.
I'm going to change the brush to something a little bit wider. One of the worst things that we can do is try to finish the entire painting with the same brush. I, I often have done uh, tutorials, but the tutorials have been about showing you the speed in which you can paint if you let go. Um, and so I've used one brush, but, but those tutorials serve a different purpose. Once you're creating artwork, you want to use everything that the, the, the brush and everything and every brush that you have available that, that can serve you. You want to be able to use everything that you have available that can serve you because not all brushes are the same. Not everything is the same, you know. Of course, most of you know that, but still, it's something. Here I'm using a palette knife. The palette knife serves me differently. And I can binge on it and try to do so many things with it, but at some point you have to change it, right? You, you can't, you can't just try to finish the same the paint. I mean, you can if you want to, but uh, you miss out on all the other things that are available with the different brushes. And you can you can stay true to the drawing if you want to or you don't have to, right? So in this case I'll make some of those glasses here. And it's that simple. One of these expressionist uh, paintings. You can get as, you can get as creative with them as you want to. 
All right, guys, my name is Jose Trujillo. I am an artist, and you guys just saw one of my oil painting sessions here. Take care, talk to you soon.